Hi, my name is Skyla, and I'm going to be talking about the Family Crisis Center and my experience there as an intern during the winter 2014 semester. The Family Crisis Center is a nonprofit organization that helps victims of domestic abuse, sexual violence, and stalking. The Crisis Center offers many services in the community and strives to help everyone that walks through their doors. Although they can't always help everybody, I have seen them do everything they can to help members of the community. If we didn't have the resources to help them, we gave them the information to contact people who would. The Family Crisis Center offered a wide variety of services for their clients. These services included a safe house for women and their children, crisis counseling, personal support, advocacy and obtaining services, support groups for women and children, legal and criminal justice advocacy, food and clothing assistance, community presentations, referrals to legal aid, referrals to scholarship programs, safety planning, and information and referrals. There aren't said things that you do every day at the Family Crisis Center, but you will have many different tasks and assignments. Interns at the Family Crisis Center have a lot of great opportunities, however, it is up to you to make the most of your experience. Don't be afraid to speak up and ask for more opportunities. They won't know that you are interested if you don't say anything. You will get the chance to be a part of many great opportunities if you want them. This list just covers a few. You can sit in during crisis counseling, assist and teach at local schools about teen dating violence and healthy relationships, help pass out food at the food bank, cashier and help to maintain and organize Second Helpings, the thrift store run by the Family Crisis Center, greet clients and answer the phone, ride along with an advocate on a crisis call, attend court meetings with clients, attend community meetings, and many others. New things come up at the center all the time and you can be a part of them. Getting an internship at the Family Crisis Center isn't hard, but a lot of students apply, so you need to be proactive. Here are some tips on how I got my internship there and how to improve your chances. The Family Crisis Center accepts interns every semester. To apply to the Family Crisis Center, you need to take a cover letter and resume in. Make sure that your name, email, and phone number are on there and clearly visible. Go in and personally take in your resume. Dress professionally. Making a good first impression is key. If you can, if you can ask to speak to Margie Harris, the director of the Family Crisis Center. The earlier, the better. You are more likely to get a call for an interview if you turn in your resume early. I would definitely recommend the Family Crisis Center to students who are interested in learning more about advocacy and have a desire to help members of the community. They will tell you that the internship is made, up, made by you. It is up to you to take the initiative to get the experience that you want. You, you need to be willing to speak up and let them know that you want experience and opportunities. Sometimes things get a little hectic and the interns are the last thing on their minds. Speak up and let them know that you would be interested in going on a call or sitting in with a client. I had a great experience and I know that others can as well. When I got my internship, I knew that I wanted to be as much of a benefit to them as I could be. My main goal was to learn as much as I could and to be the best intern I could possibly be. I asked questions and I took the initiative. I learned quickly and tried to make my schedule work as well as possible with the needs of the Family Crisis Center. I contributed my own thoughts, opinions, and knowledge that I have gained at B Brigham Young University, Idaho to help think of the best ways possible to help clients. I definitely recommend the Family Crisis Center as an internship opportunity. I learned so much and had a great experience. Feel free to contact them or go in to see them if you have any further questions.